buzzing already and with good cause. Two top sides ready to go at it and this should be something special on the pitch. It's Villarreal, they take on Real Madrid and it's coming up next on EA TV. Hello everyone, ahead of the action and we're certainly looking forward to it here at the Estadio de la Ceramica. I'm Derek Ray and with me here on the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And coming up, pulsating action from La Liga EA Sports. It's Villarreal and they take on Real Madrid. Thanks Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully we get a really good game here. He could pick out a teammate. And out for what will be a Villarreal throw. And here's a look at the starting 11 for Villarreal. Well, for a while, everybody played with a 4-4-2. And it can still be a very good system. But it does rely very much on your front two getting the better of their markers. And the wide midfield players being good in 1v1 situations. Let's hope they play it well today. And let's dissect the Real Madrid side. Thibaut Courtois begins in goal. Carvajal starts with Ferlon Mendy in the fullback positions. Federico Valverde plays alongside Jude Bellingham in the centre of midfield. And so many different ways to configure an attack in this. Oh, surely! In it goes! An early opening statement in this match. And look at the celebrations. Well, as you can see, he hits this with so much power, but just look at the follow-through. So athletic. That's a dynamic strike. So the match has restarted, 1-0 here. Valverde. On to Mendy. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. Well, using the space really well, but now can they push on? How about the cross? Rodrigo. And on to Bellingham. Ball retention, so important. Good use of the ball as they look. Genuine chance, and it's in! Real Madrid firmly in charge here. Well, just look at the setup here. It's such a clever back heel. And then Kroos finishes it brilliantly. He strikes the ball cleanly and gives the goalkeeper absolutely no time to react. It's a really good goal. So underway again, and a 2-0 advantage here. Santi Comesagna. Strong play here. Good use of advantage by the referee. Mosqueira. Good movement. Chance to cross. Parejo. Goalkeeping of the highest order. Well, he's got to be pleased with that save. It's absolutely magnificent. Who's going to get on the end of it? And clears the danger.
Valverde. Well, possibilities in the centre. Plays it back. Oh, good defending to stop a decent looking attack. His determination there for all to see. Alberto Moreno. Moreno. And a very good challenge. And decent acreage for Real Madrid to run into. And a simple clearance, a good one. Using his physical strength to shield it. Eduardo Camavinga. Determined defending. Just have to make sure they don't get caught on the counter-attack. Parejo. Now with Fernandez. Eder Militao. Carvajal. Now Eder Militao. Fine sequence of passes. Tony Kroos. And Bellingham. And Real's creative tendencies coming to the fore. Very effective. Opportunity. Oh, tremendous work from the keeper to avert the danger. Parejo. Nicely cut out. Well, there's a really stylish piece of running. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Well, half-time coming up, and this is not exactly what the home fans came to see. Stuart, your thoughts on what we've seen? Well, they've struggled in this first half. They've been outfall, outplayed, and outrun. They need to improve all aspects of their play in the second half if they're to get back in this one. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Well, breaking at pace is always a possibility. Rodrigo. Real Madrid have given us away. Santi Comesanya. And just one minute of time added on for stoppages. Vinicius Junior. And Bellingham. And so it is. The first half has come to an end here at the Estadio de la Ceramica. Well, Federico Valverde, one man who's certainly not hiding out there. He's been great to watch. Yeah, he's certainly carved out plenty of chances. He's tested the keeper on numerous occasions, and he got his reward with that goal. Brilliant stuff from him. And the ball rolling again after what was a dazzling first 45 from Real. Can they repeat that in the second half? A creative look about this. Well, the referee wasn't going to let that go. Fed over towards the back post. Well, when it left the boot, I thought it might have a chance of fooling the keeper, but it didn't. Vinicius Junior. This is Kroos. 
Could cross it in here. Defence of Brazilians to shut them down. A chance maybe from the wide position. And a fine cross. Decent position. Now to play Real Madrid throw here. Here it is now, a substitution. Carvajal. Jude Bellingham. Vinicius Junior. Rodrigo. Is it going to be? And this time it's in! Fabulous goal! And just look at the celebrations! Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. But I think the keeper has made a mistake here. While it's a decent finish, it should go in at that near post. Well, he knows his team haven't been good enough in this game. But how does he change it? So the action continues and Real very much bossing the proceedings. Gonzalo Getsch. And the ball with Sir Lott. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Mendy. Federico Valverde. Rodrigo. And Valverde. A wilting under the pressure. And now they try to go forward. Real defensive resilience. And the post getting in the way. Corner given to Real Madrid. Substitution for Real Madrid. Elects to go short. Rudiger. And on to Bellingham. Danger averted for now, but it'll be another corner. And short it is. Angles it back. Very quick thinking there. Gonzalo Getsch. Gonzalo Getsch now. And return to Getsch. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Carvajal. Oh, fancy footwork. Carvajal. Now with Rodrigo. Nicely timed tackle. Alberto Moreno. Likes to run with the ball at his feet. Gonzalo Gerdish. Determined defending. Valverde Federico Valverde Rodrigo good looking move Morales Mosqueira now Parejo
Santi Comesagna just wasn't going to part with the ball and lining it up Moreno well they stopped them in their tracks good idea Vinicius and a goal he's put it away a celebratory moment well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Carvajal. Now, Eder Militao. Valverde and now Rodrigo Vinicius Jr on to cross foiling his opponent completely there has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes and now both sides will make personnel switches It's a short one. Tony Kors. On the ball, Rudiger. And return to Kors. Kors. Shaping to shoot. And he's made it a brace for himself. The defender is just unable to stay with him. And he's having a field day. Well, as the replay shows, that's such a brilliant bit of skill to set up the chance. And when he gets onto it, he holds off the challenge, keeps his balance and makes good contact with the ball. That's a top-class finish. Oh my goodness, it's so one-sided. 5-0 in this match. There will be three minutes added on at the end. Well, no point in stopping play. Advantage with them. Gonzalo Getsch. Manu Trigueros has it. The fans want to see a shot. Has the strength to hang on to it. Tony Kors. And there goes the final whistle. It's gone the wrong way as far as the home fans are concerned. Well, Derek, that just wasn't good enough today. A lack of a game plan, too many players below par, and not enough energy all around the pitch. A really worrying performance for me. His performance in this particular game will have impressed many people, Stuart. Well, what more could you ask for? His build-up play was clever, his movement was dynamic, and he scored a couple of goals. What a player he is.